the Houston Center for Contemporary Craft is serving up a delicious new exhibition. Curatorial fellow Catherine Hall tells us what's on the menu. Dining and Discourse addresses the long-standing relationship between craft and dining. Uh, the exhibition itself is laid out much like a progressive menu with three different dining room vignettes. The first vignette is entitled Role Play, which really kind of looks at the dining room from a design perspective, thinking about the formal constructs of line, form, shape, and color, and how that plays into the dining room. The second uh, theme kind of delves a little bit further into the history of presenting man's dominion over nature, so integrating the hunt into the dining room, as well as thinking about the interplay uh, between craft and dining in terms of these topics of sustainability in food and craft practice. And then the third vignette really kind of looks at um, Opulence and Excess is the title, and it really looks at kind of uh, the history of the decorative arts in terms of using ornamentation and um, material and, uh, in order to kind of um, denote certain social class or social status. Craft has a really long-standing history with the dining room, and I think oftentimes when you look at the history of art, you'll see certain craft-based objects in certain still lives, for instance. One kind of thinks of uh, maybe even the Vanitas paintings of Spain and thinking about handmade objects. But, you know, I think really the idea behind this exhibition was to look at the objects that we take for granted on an everyday basis, looking at our flatware and our plateware, cups, bowls, um, the dining room table, and kind of thinking about what craft has done to influence our relationship with those objects on a daily basis. Hall explains that Dining and Discourse was born from Dining and Discourse, and she hopes the conversation continues with visitors to the exhibition. A lot of the ideas behind these vignettes are really kind of inspired by different conversations that were had across the dinner table with friends and colleagues. And uh, in terms of selecting the work, um, one of two things happened. I either approached artists and I knew pieces that I wanted in the exhibition, or I approached artists and asked for them to create something for a particular theme. And so it's really kind of been an interesting conversation between all of us together in terms of what you see uh, presented today. And I'll, I'll say too, I think it's important to note that uh, the artists represented in this exhibition are from all different you know, places throughout the country. There's a good regional standing, but um, also wanting to think too about different points of their career and having that being represented as well. I really hope that visitors can come in and bring their own experiences and relationships that they have with the everyday objects in their home uh, into the exhibition space when they, they come in and observe. And I really hope, too, there are different ways for visitors to participate by checking out the uh, exhibition's Tumblr blog, diningdiscourse.tumblr.com where you can follow all of the artists through a variety of media and also kind of share your own thoughts. For more information about Dining and Discourse and other current exhibitions at the Houston Center for Contemporary Craft, visit their website at www.crafthouston.org. For Artbeat, I'm Stacy Hawkins.